Hi, right, and welcome back. Right now we have Michael Cation in the field with Kendra Cody and Leslie Kirsting. Here you go, Mike. Well, I'm sitting here now with Leslie Kirsting and Kendra Cody, both seniors and members of the Baker softball team. Girls, thanks for joining us. Well, Leslie, talk to me a little bit about how the team has done so far this year. You've played quite a few games so far, and you've got a lot to play still. Talk to me about how you guys have played overall as a team. Uh, we started out pretty good, and this past week and a half we've been struggling a little bit. But I think we're still kind of finding our way and getting used to playing with each other. So hopefully in the rest of our conference games, now that conference is really getting underway, we'll really step up and come together as a team. This question is for you, Kendra. Talk to me about the returners and how they've been playing so far, as well as some of the new players that have kind of stepped it up. Um, I think we've been struggling both offensively and defensively. We're working through our defensive struggles right now, and I think we've gotten a lot better with reducing errors and uh, supporting our pitchers. But I think offensively, we still need to make the hits when it matters and really score some runners. We're leaving a lot of runners on base. Kendra, talk to me about the pitching so far. I know that you're pitching as well as a couple new girls as well. So three uh, fairly new pitchers out there on the mound. And talk to me about how they're doing so far. Well, let's see. Um, Returner-wise, like Alexis has been doing a great job of calling the games. And offensively, she's finally starting to come around. She had a home run yesterday against Lindenwood. And... Um, I think Jade Allen stepped up pretty big time in the outfield. She has she's playing center this year, and so she's having to take control out there. And as far as um, the freshmen, I mean Stephanie Nelson is having to pitch this year, and she's given the number one spot, so she's got a lot of responsibility on her shoulders. Um, the others, they're they have they're out there in starting roles, and so you know just um, being able to learn what their role is and having to adjust to that and knowing that they're being counted on big time to come through is what they need to just keep improving on. Um, Stephanie, um, she started out really strong. Lately she's been struggling a little bit, but um, I think like getting back into school and where we're throwing every day, that's going to help her a lot um, develop more pitches besides just her fastball to rely on. And um, I'm, I'm improving. <laughs> I guess it's uh, pretty different being out there in game situations when I haven't really thrown since freshman year. So, and then I actually started against Lindenwood, and so that's my first college start. Leslie, talk to me about uh, hitting so far. Who stepped it up? Who would you like to see maybe improve a little bit? Who's uh, really playing well and and uh, scoring the runs for you guys? Um, I think our first four batters in our lineup have really stepped up and have been consistent. That is um, Kendra and Jade, uh, Jade and um, Marianne Dugan. They're uh, go-to hitters and you can count on them to get on base. And also, like Kendra said, Alexis is our number four batter and she's been doing really well. I think as far as improving the rest of the lineup, uh, consistency wise I know like I'm very up and down I'll be hitting really good and then I can't get on base so and I think that's the way with a lot of the bottom of the lineup is just getting consistent and being able to be uh, in that RBI situation and be able to score the runners. Leslie talk to me about the overall goals for uh, your team and and uh, for you as well. Um, as a team I know we're trying working towards being competitive in conference and being in the top of our conference. We've split two conference games now, so it's really important that we start sweeping teams or at least stick with that splitting. Um, and individually, I just really want to get consistent and be a go-to player and be a leader on the team. Kendra, talk to me a little bit about uh, your individual goals. It's your senior year, final year here on the Baker softball team. What would you like to accomplish this year? Individually, um, well, I've made first team all conference for the past three years, so definitely stick to doing that. And um, basically improve, improve my batting average from last year, improve defensively from last year, and just go out knowing that I've given it everything and that there's nothing I regret. 
Leslie, kind of the same question. What are your individual goals, and what has being on the Baker softball team meant for you? Um, it's been a really positive experience so far, and I definitely want to end on a positive note. And same like Kendra, feeling like I left everything out on the field. And so I just, I don't know, being successful is definitely a big part of it, and just feeling like I was successful is going to help too. All right. Well, Leslie, Kendra, thanks a lot for joining us today, and uh, we hope uh, you have a great season this year. Good luck. We'll send it back to you guys. Thanks, Mike. We'll be back after this short break.